And it's been very but damaging. But do you now admit that the, the deficit which they inherited, the structural deficit, was much greater than you ever said you, when you and Gordon Brown were running the well, economy? Uh, of course. And everybody knows now, in retrospect... So the IMF say it's 78 billion. Well, I'm not sure about the IMF number. And we'd need to look at the details of that. And I'm not sure what the OBR number is. The point I've always well, the made... The IMF number is 78 billion. We've yeah. all been checking it this morning. And uh, I don't know that, whether that's that number... That's what they say in 2007. I don't know if that number is right. But, 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 but the debate we've always had is... You see, the charge... Because you, you used to say there was no deficit inherited, didn't the you? The charge against didn't, Labour... Didn't you? Isn't look, that right? The charge against Labour... The charge against Labour was that in 2006 and 2007, mm. at that time, mm. Labour was running an irresponsible structural deficit. And what I've always said was, at that time, that wasn't the case. Nobody was saying that. George Osborne said he would match our spending plans. Of course, then, you have the global financial yeah. crisis. In retrospect, right. it is now clear but that the, the underlying growth was This weaker. is what you said on the BBC at the beginning of last year. I don't think we had a structural deficit at that period. Yeah. At that time, at that yeah, time, but, but we are talking about. 2007. Yeah. But you're now saying that you accept it may not have been as big as 78 yeah. billion, but there was a deficit of 78 billion.